Listen, if you want to see the full version of this interview without waiting until part 75, <laughs> hit the join button right next to the subscribe button and become a VIP member for just $2.99 a month. While you're at it, turn the red subscribe button gray and hit the notification bell. All right, now VIPs, enjoy the clip. <laughs> After that tragedy, um, you release. I think that's when you release my experience, right? No, I did that um this year. I did a little tape before that. Oh yeah, got you. I um remember me. I did that, and but I wasn't like in my. You know what I'm saying? I wasn't in my yeah in my element. So then, you know, I, I got my back together, and then I put um experience and experience is basically saying everything that happened. Yeah, from. As I said, I came home and I got hit up, tried to take me out the game, and I just—it's just a story, basically, so yeah. you can understand like your life and yeah. what you do through the trials and tribulations. So. You also speak about um your mother fighting cancer. Yeah, I didn't even know. Oh, you didn't know the whole time she was fighting cancer when I was locked up. She ain't say nothing. She ain't say nothing at all. So then, that's what I'm trying to show you why, like, I really like if my mother say I'm um, she not mad at me and I do some ill, I don't give. A Nobody else say you know what I'm saying Like As long as she Is like She good And she know like I, right, I'm My son I'm good with my son Whatever he do Cause at the end of the day That's who's always gonna be On your side Depending on how y'all grew up It's just mm -hmm. me and her So When I come home now I don't know What's going on bro And in two weeks Prior to me Come home I'm in the hospital So I just did five years In jail Come home I'm in the hospital Right before my birthday I'm in the I'm In my birthday Tubes in me And all that Balloons in my hospital bed That's not supposed to Celebrate my birthday mm -hmm. And the whole time This lady going through this By herself You feel me mm -hmm. So now After the fact That's when like I held up And she's like doing her chemo And so That fake hurt Cause you know she a body That's why I said This chemo still give her pain Cause he's still be in pain After Damn. I never experienced Nothing like that like my, my grandma had breast cancer She had cut off her breast You feel me Then trickled down to my mom's But my mom's like I guess she didn't want to go through it while I was in jail because she said here like, who going to send my son the packages? Who going to make sure? Every bro, I went to the package room 38 weeks straight, bro. From like, not just my mom's, but you know what it is to go to, like, it's 52 weeks in a year, bro. Yeah. I went to the package room 38 weeks straight. Great. Every week my name getting called. Yeah. Niggas is like, nah, son. Niggas love this nigga, bro. Yeah. My son Siggy, when I first got up there, I'm on the phone with the nigga from eight in the morning to eight at night. Yeah. You know how much you gotta pay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a fact. That's like a fact. shit like that. I like my homegirl, Lulu, right before a riot happened, I made her send, I think it was like 15 or 20 Purdue chickens in another nigga name. Yeah. And that's the homeboy I said that he was he ran in and he started getting it on with two niggas and I ran in and jumped in. Gotcha. I ain't getting none of that food, bro. So that's two, three, four hundred dollars. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, that's like the blessings. Like when you knock, it's it's mostly females that's gonna really hold you down. Yeah, I you know what I'm saying. That too. It's yeah. mostly females. So when you got a good female friend, like me and Lulu stopped talking for mad long over. Like she was mad at me about some shit. Like she thought I knew. I didn't really know. I'm telling her I didn't know. Mm -hmm. She's mad at me. But then fast, we we patched it back up. We seen each other, gave each other a little ah, uh, you know. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. I just I just hold dear to the people that like. Come through for you Yeah So my mom's is like No matter what it is Like I didn't know none of that So now I got, I'm I'm back now I'm going to the gym I got my shit back I'm, You know what I'm saying Now she doing chemo So I'm taking her to chemo appointments I'm doing this and that And like She like Yo I'm in pain And, she, uh, and I'm like Yo, Come on come to the gym And she's she like I can't I mean I can't uh, And that shit You know you lose your head And all like Bro, I shit, I done broke down and cried mad times, bro. Of course, of course. But I still, you know what I mean? I, I, when I leave the door, I leave all that shit right there because I'm still outside. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Or oh, I stay in the crib and I, I was taking my mom every week. We have like every Tuesday, I'll take her out to eat. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting money, I'm giving her bread, I'm doing a little, you know what I'm saying? Send go to Dubai, yo, here, take 5000 huh? So when I could do shit like that, I feel good. Like, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yeah, nah, that's what's up. How she doing now? Now nah, she gooch. She beat it and all that. Yeah, right? gotcha. she gooch. Gotcha. 